Happy Friday, Cornerstone. I'm excited that we get to join together and read our devotional. I hope you guys have an awesome Friday. Um, today we'll be reading from our indescribable devotional. And this one is called Beautiful and Unbreakable. We are pressed on every side by troubles, but we are not crushed. 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 8. Nothing sparkles like a diamond. But they aren't just pretty to look at. Diamonds are also the hardest natural substance known to man. In fact, the word diamond comes from a Greek word that means unbreakable. Only another diamond can make a scratch on a diamond. They're so tough that they're sometimes used in tools for cutting, grinding, and drilling. Diamonds are rare and expensive because they only form under very special conditions. A diamond is made of pure carbon, like graphite, which is your pencil lead. But in order for a diamond to form, extreme pressures and incredibly hot temperatures are needed over a very long period of time. This usually happens about a hundred miles below the Earth's crust. So volcanoes make very good diamond factories. When the volcano erupts, the diamonds shoot up towards the Earth's surface. So, in a very dark place, under a lot of pressure and stress and heat, something beautiful and unbreakable forms. Have you ever been in a dark place? Under a lot of pressure and stress? Could it be that God was using that time to make something beautiful and unbreakable? When you feel as if you're being pressed in on every side by trouble, don't give up. God won't let you be crushed. He'll use those hard times to make you stronger and to teach you to depend on Him. Trust Him, especially when it's hard. He's making something beautiful and unbreakable. Your faith in Him. Let me read the Be Amazed. A carat is used to measure how much a diamond weighs. One carat equals 200 milligrams, or about the same size as a raindrop. The biggest diamond ever found is the Cullinan diamond, found in 1905 in a mine in South Africa. It, weigh, or it is 3,106 carats, that's one and a third pounds, or about the same weight as a guinea pig. The diamond was cut into about a hundred pieces, with the biggest piece called the Great Star of Africa. It's 530 carats and mounted in the Royal Scepter of Britain. You know, when we're going through hard times, stressful times, maybe it seems like there's a lot of pressure, a lot of pressure to do schoolwork the right way. Uh, a lot of scary times with the coronavirus all around us. We're reminded that in these hard times, that we have a God who won't give up on us, that he's with us always and he's helping us. So let's go ahead and go to prayer this morning. I invite you to pray along with me. Lord Jesus, thank you that you are with us, that you're our good shepherd, and that when we go through these difficult circumstances, Lord, we can take confidence in knowing, God, that you're making something beautiful, our faith. You're making us like Jesus, and you use these times to teach us and to grow us. Help us, Lord, be mindful of what you're doing in our lives. And may we never forget that you are with us. Today, Lord, I pray a blessing over the students as they go about their remote learning. Would you help them as they do their math and their reading and their language arts and their Spanish and their uh, extracurriculars and uh, PE and music and all of those, Lord? We're so thankful that we get to do that. But God, we need your help to do it well. God, sometimes it might feel like it's really stressful, but God, would during those times, would you help us remember that we're not alone, that you can help us, and that you're in control. And so God, help us work today as if we're working for you. And we pray that you would receive glory in those things. We pray that in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys. Happy Friday. Have a great day. Bye.